Hello! So a new card system has just come out on Grand Cross. Um, most of y'all that saw, you know, from the past shows will be like, whoa, how, how does that work? And essentially, you get these um, card packs, you open them, hope you get one that's good. And um, with that, you can use them to get stats in most PV activities and geared PvP as well. And so far, all of it is farmable. No paid uh, way of getting into any of these car these packs. Hopefully that's how they'll keep it. I hope that's how it, how it will remain. I would much rather this continue being full on free to play than have any pay system at all. And so far, so good. Um, so this is, these are all the stickers you can get. And each individual one gives different stats, as you can see. All of them have different stats. Some have higher rarity. Ra rarity. Some have ra higher rarity. You can see, uh, you know, uncommon, rare, SR, SSR, and stuff like that. And, you know, there's multiple. There's so many. Uh, common as well right here. There's so many. And they pretty much represent um, chapters, you know? I don't know if, if, if it's chapters from story or chapters from the manga. It should be from story. Um, and stuff like that, but, you know, you can see backgrounds as well. There's multiple to collect, and so far you can collect all of them for the play. And if you collect sets like these, you get an extra boost out of them as well. Never really been collecting much. I actually only have been looking how to get them. And this might, you know, I might be missing some ways of getting them. But so far, this is these are all the ways I found of how to get packs. And uh, I'll be opening some of them as well here in this video. But first of all, daily mission. Daily mission will give you one of this pack every day for completing the tree um, from Ragnarok, which I'll, I'll take you in a second there. And you get this pack, the um, uh, the starter pack one. It's how it's called. And these are the rates, 10% rate for an, for an SR. These are all the packs in there. I want to get this. I'll just want... Oh, this Ascanor in... in uh, Ooh, 500 HP, okay. Yeah, you can get these cards. I already got this for today, so I'm gonna be opening it today as well. Uh, this, is, this is this mission, if I take you right here. Memory of I I I I Igor. Um, you beat this once, it's easy. You can even use skip tickets and you get the mission. Also, you, you get this currency, right, from beating it. Global players haven't had this yet, because uh, Ragnarok hasn't released yet, but... Also a way of getting some of these currencies as well, or some of these items as well. So, uh, that's that. Um, we go back here. Patrol gives you one every 12 hours as well. This one right here. So you can see, I j just put like half an hour ago. And you get also the starter. No, this is a um, season one. This is a season one pack. And 10% for SR. These are the ones you can get from that. Uh, this is one you get for free, by the way. This is why I have it. Just by doing like a tutorial on how to get them. And uh, this is the patrol. There is one you can farm from the hell uh, boss stages. You can farm them actually. So you can farm this one. The uh, CR1. And this is the rewards. It's not very great. Oh, actually. Are these different? I think they are. So... Is it different every stage? Oh no, it's not. Okay, I thought it was, okay. So this this is one of them. Of course, if you want to just complete the collection, you should also farm this. Not many, you know, high rar rarities, but you know, if you want to get this one, for no reason at all, that's also a good one to get, you know? So this is one you can farm. Uh, you can buy them on the uh, guild store, store and everything. Let me go to the boar hat, because then I can go to the um, individual stores here. Or, or the merchants, right? You can go to the merchants, and you can buy one per week out of each one of them. And they are more, you know, special ones. So this is the PvP merchant, right? The PvP one. And in the... Not the gold one. Not the, the gear one. What is it? Here, gold from this section, you can get another... Um, Season 1, which I'll, I'll get 5 actually, 5 Season 1's which I'll get for 500 coins each. And you can get this background one for 10,000, I'll get it, just because um, I'm guessing this is the only way of getting it. 
and that is it for the merchant merchant the pvp merchant that is but moving on to the another merchant here the uh glocks merchant with for bra you can get this chapter one oh man i just spent my uh my uh my coins like yesterday on these i should have kept them. i mean i didn't know they were gonna come out but you can get five of these per reset and these oh i can see what they drop okay let me actually buy one so i can see what they drop i'm gonna go in, gonna go in my inventory give me a second this is my inventory right yeah if i click on it is it gonna open no okay good Oh, it can drop SSR. Okay. These 5% chance of dropping SSR. Oh, oh, if I can get the Escanor SSR one, that'll be sick. Okay. Yeah, this is one. This is a big one then. This is a huge one. And this is a, this, I'll talk about this in a second, but this is a huge one then. Uh, from the Glocks Merchant. You can drop the SSR ones. Pretty expensive. A thousand coins. I mean,. If you get a high position on the uh, the bra, you can get uh, like 1,800, 2,000 every day. But if you're not, that can be very expensive. Any others in here? No. Okay, so this is for the Glocks Merchant. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't have any more coins on that. I, again, I, I literally had like 6,000 yesterday and I bought all these. No, I bought, I bought three of these, three of these, I believe, yesterday. So, unfortunate. If I knew, I would have kept it. Now, from the Guild Merchant, you can have this one right here. Which is, I, again, I can't, I can't, I'm gonna buy them, and then we're gonna take a look at them, but I, I what, what can I not see them? Reach out. Um, it was this one. Okay, so these are like the enemies, right? Oh, I can drop this one as well from this pack, okay, good, good. So, another good pack right there. Um, and I believe you can also get... It's not a pack, but for from Belmont or uh, Belmont, um, you can. It's not a pack, but you can get this one, which is an SSR one. It's an eight point five percent drop. Five, it has a point. It's not. Sorry, it's a point five percent. So uh, keep on doing it. It, it. Was it on hell? I saw it. It was on hell, right? Yeah, on hell. It has a bro a point five. Percent. What, what about the other difficulties? Normal. Can you even drop? No. You have to do hell. 0.5% chance of dropping this one. Okay. But, you know, it's for your collection. I guess I'll keep doing hell from now on. I was only doing normal because there was no reason to do hell. But I guess, I guess now there is a reason to do hell. Um, it's not a pack, but, you know, it is one of the, one of the stickers or whatever cards. Uh, so, there's right now an event as well. For the summer stuff that you can get one of this pack the cigarette pack which will guarantee drop this one which is good because it's a good one by the stat right there um this boss right here has an exchange where you can get this one which is guaranteed as well very good very good stats it drops right there as well it's a really cool card as well and um on the bingo i don't know if you can still see it probably can on the bingo I've already done it. Yeah, I can see because I've already done it. But the on the bingo, one of the rewards also is the other one. It's the Sigurd one. There's this one right here, which is an R, but that's fine. Um, so I, I think there's one more. But um, g give me a second. I'm going to look it up real quick. Well, I can't really find it, but I think it is four packs. And I'm just missing one of them. And I can't find them. Uh, but those packs are there as well. These are special. Whenever this comes out on Global, make sure to do them so, so you can get these. I don't know if they're going to be super exclusive or anything like that. So what's missing now is uh, I don't believe you get them from doing Knighthood Boss. I don't believe so. Uh, let's go for the rewards. No, you don't get them from doing Knighthood Boss. Okay. This is something that, you know, I've been looking at all the game modes and stuff. Um, but you can you get them from daily, uh, tr oh, sorry, training dungeon. So training dungeon has a rare chance of dropping packs as well now. Bro, my, my blue stacks is all bugged. I, I, I People have given me suggestions how to fix it. I cannot fix it. I've been halfway on this one. Does the gold battle drop in? I know the other ones do. 
No, the gold battle doesn't. Let me back out real quick. But here, let's go to level two, for example. You can see I have a chance of dropping this one, which is a pretty decent one. But let me let me clear this gold battle real quick and uh, look for a level three so we can see the rates on the level three. Okay, done with the battle. Just put a random four blue units is how I do it. Um, and at level three, if the game lets me, okay. Po -po 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 -po. Yeah, thirty-six percent chance of getting this pack. No, it's five. It's a five percent. I'm sorry, I, I read thirty-six percent chance of getting a gold, thirty percent chance of getting a hammer, five percent chance of getting a pack, which can get these characters. And a 1% chance of getting this background here. Okay. So I was gonna I was gonna farm these or not farm, but I was gonna beat these and then record my opening, but because it's only a 5% chance, I don't know if I'm really gonna get anything from this. So these are all the forms I have I, I have found. Uh if there are any that I missed out on that you guys know of, uh, let me know in the comments. There are of course gonna be new forms added in the future, and definitely there will be um new um exclusive you know packs coming out in the future as well so you know those i can just predict but if, if there are any packs that i just missed out on because i couldn't find them let me know in the comments that'll be very helpful um for me and for others as well so let's open the ones i have and hope uh no sorry it's in the inventory hope i got good stuff so let's open first the these exclusive ones because those are guaranteed those are gonna be ooh. Those are going to be, you know, guaranteed stuff, so there's not much exciting stuff to get. These are the, this is the animation, though. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I definitely should, I'm definitely going to farm the boss one. Okay, so this was a set, and this will give me um, a special thing as well, a special bonus. Can I open all five? No. Oh, it says... Oh, yeah, there's the coin shop. Yes, 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 yes. In the friend coin shop, there are... Oh, almost forgot. Okay, I, remember, I had seen these. I just completely forgot about them. In the gold coin... In the, sorry, the, the friendship coin shop, you can get some packs as well. These two packs right here. And you can get this um, card here as well. So I'm going to get two of these. Because... Wait, does, does the other one also have the Escalator? It does not. This right here has the Ascanor versus Tarosa one. And this is one I hope I pull. So I'm gonna get two of these. Nice. I can only get one, okay. One per um day, I'm assuming. So I'm gonna get one of each then. Okay. Come on. One per day, I'm assuming. Oh, I'm so dumb. I can just click on it. Um and, and it will take me where... Okay, here. Show me where to get. Show me where to get. Is it gonna be like the PvP store? I think so. Oh, well. Never mind. It's a PvP shop. That's how you get that one. Is it gonna take me there? Yeah, it, it's Glocks. It's Glocks. Okay, never mind. Alright. That's a way of, of finding it, I guess. But let's open these. I can only open one by one? Question mark? I can open all six. Oh, I got a cute one. Open the next one. Okay. I don't think these have anything really exciting on them. Um, but, you know. I, I got a repeat. So, yeah, a repeat becomes an upgrade material so you can upgrade others. Gilfander, looking good. Oh, it's the fake Meliodas. Surprises in that pack. Like that specific pack with like Gil Thunder and stuff. I thought that the movie was gonna get us like a separate one. Okay, let's open these. Got background. Okay. Mm, no SR so far. 
I would love an SR. Ah, I like that background, but I love an SR. I don't like it that much. Relax. <laughs> okay. Let's uh. Wait, where's my uh? I swear I got a pack from. That's okay, but I swear I got a pack from uh. What's it called? The the farming the uh, the boss stages. I guess I didn't. Okay, so this is the Glox one. No, this is uh. No, it wasn't great either, but. This is a Glocks one. Please, SSR! <laughs> okay. Um, if you don't know how to use them, whenever you go inside a stage... I got like achievement probably for doing like 10 things. Whenever you go inside of a stage, before it starts, you click here. Select, and you can select whichever you want. This is the one thing I like about this. You can mix and match whatever extra stats you want. And in the future, I believe, I think this is going to be kind of crazy, right? You're going to have so many that you can choose from. And look, like, look at how much more HP I'm getting, right? Just from these cards. This one seems to get good stuff. Look at how much more HP I got from that, you know? So, this is gonna be probably... How much HP can my ass gonna get? Give me a second. We put an HP heavy link as well. Cluedo. And then put HP food. Yeah, 238, you know? Because I'm getting myself an extra 2.7k right there, so... I like the system so far, I hope they keep it through the play strictly, no monetization on the system at all. I, I'm, I'm asking for too much maybe, I don't know, but that's how I hope they keep it. And uh, yeah, that's the card system.